Hello, what's up Midwest Front Page, Midwest Jim with Midwest Heather, and today's a very special day. It's Midwest Mom's birthday! And we're going to take her on a special surprise trip, so come with us if you may. Come with us. So where are we going? I don't know, but it's a long one lane road over an hour to get to our destination. You're going to find out in just a little bit. Welcome to Chester, Illinois. Home of the Popeye Museum. Home of Popeye. Here's Wimpy and his burger. How you doing, Wimpy? Chester, Illinois. Over here, I see... Is this olive oil? What is today's day? Date? Today is July 20th because it's Midwest Mom's birthday. We we sent her inside because that's where the air conditioning is. And she was super surprised and really excited because she had, she's she been wanting to come here. Oh, it's super hot. It's, uh, it's 100 degrees outside. Yeah. We drove uh, down a long two-lane highway to get here. Let's see if the uh, let's see if the drinking fountain's working. Like I said, it's no, oh, no, drinking fountain's not working. It's over 100 degrees out here. See, historical Chester, Illinois, Popeye statue, bunch of cool stuff. There's 15 Popeye, sta Popeye character statues around town. We're going to get a map. Go yes, we are. They got a nice little plaza out front. You can take a picture, stick your head in the picture, and be the character to give me Popeye, Wimpy. What's the baby's name? Oh, Midwest Heather went inside because it's too hot. Chester Square. Yes, what's the baby's name? I don't remember. Oh, no. We have a little too. We'll go right in here. Oh, the minimum min 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 pieces right there. This is really not a bad trip if you're from St. Louis. It took about an hour to get here. Hour and a half. Hour and a half. It depends on what side you're coming from. Let's open the door, start the adventure. Oh, sweet pea. Oh, sweet pea? Mm -hmm. Cool. And there she is, Midwest Mom. Happy birthday, Midwest Mom. Thank you. How do you feel? Good. Was it a good trip up here? It was. All right. It, like I said, it's really not that long. They got a lot of really cool stuff here. They have all the comic books here. There's, there's 18 statues up so far in the town. So I've given her the map. You're at number two at Wimpy outside the door. Gotcha. This is the building, the opera house that the real Wimpy owned. Oh, really? The creator worked here, so she's got to trifold with that with the real people, the real Popeye, the real Olive, the real Wimpy from Chester, and then the creator and stuff. Cool. Uh, huh? Yeah. Oh. While we're checking out these T-shirts, this should give you some time to like and subscribe this video and ring that notification bell. Why, you ask? That's how YouTube knows that we have fans. Have you had anybody famous come in here in a while? Anybody famous? Yes. No, the last famous one that I had was Phil Paxton. Oh, cool. But I mean, he's dead now. Yeah. Yeah, it's a sad story. So I asked the worker, have you had anybody famous come in here lately? She said, Bill Paxson. Right. So many t-shirts in this place. The owner must own a printing company. So what's this duck? What's, what's the duck? What duck? This duck right here. No, that's, he's, that's deep. 
That's Jeep? That's, yeah. What's it? Up or, here. Oh, where? The vehicle's named after the Jeep. Here, up here. Oh, I see oh, him. Really? I thought it was a duck. No. Oh. He, like we're a human, he's a, a Jeep. I got like you. A dog or a cat. Right. Wow, I really hope I didn't offend that lady. <laughs> she let me know that that dog looking thing is named Jeep. That's what the Jeep is made is oh, named look, after. Mickey. Even Mickey's here. Here's where all the bears are hanging out. Okay, let's go check out the town. See these statues. We got a bunch of dolls here, including a bear. The bear is protecting them, including Ronald. Hi, Ronald. How you doing? I guess he didn't feel like talking. All kinds of books. The activity book. So the name of this place is the Spinach Can Collectibles. And it is the Popeye Shop and Museum, 1001 State Chester, Illinois, 62233. And the phone number is 618 826 So on the way here, we passed, we passed four Dollar Generals on the one street while driving. Is Dollar General's known for being in small towns? I don't know, it sure seems like it. But every single little town we went through, I think I like this. Every single little town we went through, I wonder how much they want for this. It's pretty cool. The little town we went through, we saw, uh, we saw a Dollar General. We counted four of them. I guess Chester Yellow Jackets is the local high school. Maybe I should buy this soda for LA Beast. Maybe he'll he'll actually drink, drink this. Oh, that's actually olive oil. But this does look, look, like, look like something that LA Beast would drink. What do you think? He definitely would. See it? Yeah. It's olive oil. I, I think so. Yeah. It wouldn't, it wouldn't matter, yeah, but still, it's, it's old, right? Yeah, it's old and it's something he shouldn't be drinking, so. Shout out to the beast. Look at all this cool stuff, man. There's somebody hiding down here. Oh, look who it is. What's the bad guy's name? Pluto. It's Pluto. Or else it's Bob's Burgers, I can't tell. <laughs> Need you having fun on your birthday, Mom? I am. You are? Cool. Did you have any idea we were going Not here? A clue. Awesome. Yep. Well, I can't really remember Popeye using a tank. Do you remember Popeye using a tank? If so, leave a comment in the comment section below. While you're at it, make sure you like and subscribe. And how can they contact us, Heather? At Midwest Fun Page at gmail.com, and if you're close to Chester, Illinois, you should stop in as well. Um, hey, uh, Mom, do you like this? It's not my style. It's not your style? Oh, it looked great on you. Oh, well. You can wear this at best. Yeah, you know, I think I will. How much is it? 35 bucks? I think I'll, I'll buy it. Okay, we're exiting through the back. There's the Midwest Beast. We're not getting in the Midwest Beast, but we're going to hang out in the heat. <laughs> Just for a few minutes. Here's where the start of the video was.
No. There's Pluto, I see Jeep, I see Popeye, there's Wimpy, and don't forget that olive oil, right over here on the wall. I showed you this statue already. It's Wimpy with his cheeseburger. Like I said before, it's about 100 degrees out here. I'm gonna go start the Midwest Beast up. We'll get the AC rolling. Come on, that's unlocked. All right, here we go. Going in the Beast, I'll be out in a minute. Heather, you know you're not supposed to climb on this wall. They have it written right here. Hey mom, I saw you on here before. That they have it. They have a sign that says, "Do not climb on wall." Shouldn't have climbed the wall, mom. No peddlers, no vendors, no solicitors. City of Chester, Illinois. Midwest Beast. Oh wow, I know there's a bridge over here. But here's the man. It's Popeye the Sailor Man. Really cool. Would you look at the size of that bridge? Unfortunately, the museum portion of the Welcome Center is not open right now. So we won't be checking that out, but it's still a cool place to stop. Wow, it's a really good view. And it was there. So that's Missouri when I realized right over there? we could have took 55 to get down Is here. Is that Missouri right over there? Down those two it's lane seven, roads. Yeah. Welcome to Illinois. Yeah. yeah. But the museum part is not open. Ooh, it feels good. Ooh, it does feel good. Bathrooms are open. The welcome center is closed. I don't know why. I'm gonna assume that's not this Missouri right over there. I bet you that goes. It makes sense because it says welcome to Illinois. Yeah. This is gonna go. Here's Lewis and Clark. Over there is Missouri. <clears throat> I think it'd be a lot, a little easier driving through Missouri to get home from here. But we got other statues to find. That's the Midwest Beast over there. I'll open up for them. We are at 
Seeger Memorial Park in Chester, Illinois. Chester, Illinois is the home of Popeye the Sailor Man. So we are here to see the Popeye statue. There's 18 statues from the Popeye series currently in Chester, Illinois, and Popeye was the first. It's been here since 1977, so let's go check it out. And what city are we in, Heather? Well, we're in Chester, but this is in Illinois. Yeah, okay. we're in Chester, but this is in Illinois. That's I thought you said what city state, are we in? State. State is okay. Illinois. Over here is Missouri. I think we might find a better way to get home. Let's try it. But we're not going home quite yet. There's not still a yet. couple more statues, right? Yes. Who's next? We're going to check out olive oil, sweet pea, and Jeep. Hope we make it that far. It's over 100 degrees out here. So when you're in Chester and you're looking for statues, go to the statue and go to, uh, up to the front. Oh, get a QR code. And that's what she's doing right now. She's looking up who, who is this. We have no idea who this is. And they got a video. Oh boy, advertisements. So who is that? It's just just an advertisement. I want to say it's Wimby. Oh, here it is. Harold Ham Gravy. Harold Ham Gravy. Ham is one of the four characters to be introduced in LZ Seeger's first published Thimble Theater cartoon. So he's an original. Oh, okay. When you go across the street, make sure you look both ways. And here is olive oil. Is that is that the uh, Jeep? It's Jeep. It's Jeep. And then Sweet Pea there. Sweet Pea. All right. This is pretty cool. The co courthouse parking lot, right over here. There's the courthouse. So this is over by the over by the courthouse. This is Bluto. This is the bad guy in our story. Duh, man. And this is the hero of our story, Midwest Mom. It's her birthday. You having fun, Midwest Mom? I am. All right. Taking all kinds of pictures. We're across the street from the, the slot machine store. They sure do love their gaming in this town. We got slot machines here. Gaming over here. Lots of trucks. Bluto, Popeye's first screen villain, 1933. Bluto's comic strip debut, 1932. Pretty cool. Bluto. Okay, so it's too hot. This is the end of the video. There is a ton more statues. Heather's gonna name some of them. Some of them, some of them off. Some of them that we've actually seen, but she's gonna let you know what all they have here. So the ones that we have gotten are Popeye, Wimpy, then Olive, Sweet Pea, and Eugene the Jeep are all together in one statue, Bluto, and then we got Harold Ham Gravy, but we are, we are hot, as we said it's about 100 degrees. So the ones that we didn't get to are Castor Oil and Whistle Hen, Sea Hag and Bernard, Coal Oil, Alice the Goon and Her Child, Poop Deck Pappy, Professor What a Snozzle, Rough House, Four Nephews, King Blozo, uh, Nana Oil, Popeye's Pups, Sherlock and Seeger, Tor, and Oscar. We did not make it to those. No, it's, it's close to 100. It's 97 right now. 
I think we're gonna go across that bridge and head home. And you know what? I swear that we were told 18, but this actually is 19. But one of them says, to, Oscar says 2022. So I don't know if that one's open yet. Mm -hmm. um, but let us know if you've ever been to Chester, Illinois. Maybe you got pictures of all the statues. Maybe you went to see all of them. Tell us your, your Popeye story. Uh, and if, if you are making your way through here, or you have a chance to come this way, it's it's pretty neat. It's it is pretty neat. Um, I'm glad we came here. Uh, Mom, did you have a happy birthday with this? Very Was this a really good surprise? Yes, big surprise. All right. So I hope you had fun. I hope you come here and visit this place, but make sure it's not 100 degrees outside. <laughs> and make sure to stop at the shop that we went to first. Everyone is, or the people who um, work there own it, are really really nice and informative and they have some really cool stuff there to see and some cool stuff you can buy yeah it was pretty cool uh lots of picture opportunities uh like i said it was too hot for us to do anything pose in front of the statues take pictures set up the camera i love doing that kind of stuff but it's just too hot we're, we're gonna come back here back in the fall probably so and we could celebrate it was heather's birthday here maybe i don't know Get well the rest of the pictures for midwest joe and for midwest heather and midwest mom and midwest finger i'm midwest jim make sure you like and subscribe and hit the notification right bell. and y'all can always email us at midwestfunpage at gmail.com Till then, till next time we see you, have a Midwest day. Only you can make it the best Midwest day ever. So far. It's up to you. Bye. So we're currently on a bridge, and they got a stoplight on the bridge. And we just felt that truck go by. <laughs> yeah, we did. It's really scary. It looks like we're about to enter Missouri. Yeah, we're about to, en about to enter Missouri. There's a barge down there. That's the Mississippi River. Before, yeah, did you say the Mississippi River or the Missouri River? River? Mississippi. Okay, Mississippi River, that's right. Hopefully this light will turn green here in a minute. But this gives us a really good view of the Mississippi River. And some of the bluffs.